Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This is your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. I want to give a shout out to Notification Gang, Key Talk Gang, even though they're really the same thing for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go ahead and like the video and hit the notification bell so you get a notification every single time I drop a video. Anyways. So, with news breaking yesterday from the family of Big Scar pretty much coming out saying that Gucci Mane did not help with the funeral at all. And then on top of all that, he asked for the chains back. Well, it looks like Gucci main wife, Keisha, has now snapped back at all those allegations and came back with her own receipts, literally. She posted a receipt to NJ Ford and Son Funeral Homes, and on the receipt, it pretty much says $10,000 was sent to the funeral home, and she also wrote a message says, payment directly to funeral home. Leave my husband alone. Now you know. Now, here are the two things, right? Now, I doubt the first thing is correct, right? Either a fake receipt was made up just to cover for Gucci. I doubt that's right. Um, now, what could be it is, you know, they could just have sent the money directly to the funeral home rather than sending it to the family which the money could have went towards anywhere so they was probably just trying to be responsible and uh, make sure that the, the money actually went to the funeral home rather than actually giving it out to the family now as far as getting the chains back you know I don't know that's kind of a gray area right there uh, but she did post this receipt pretty much showing that hey we did our part on trying to cover the funeral but instead of giving it to the family we gave it literally directly to the funeral home and she also said he did this out of the goodness of his heart and then on top of that, she said, we also sent flowers and not even a thank you with a broken heart. You already know, as more pieces to the puzzle is put together, somebody's clout chasing, either the Big Scar family side or either Gucci side. And now here's the things, either either he hung up in their face and didn't actually pay it and this is fake, or he hung up in their face because they was probably talking about sending them the money directly to them, sending them the 10K directly to the family rather than just sending it directly to the funeral funeral home uh, one of those gotta be cap you know what i'm talking about i don't know which one it is uh but like i say these are receipts i don't think they will take the time to print up a whole receipt but then of course this is the music industry and they always say believe half of what you see none of what you hear or maybe the reverse i don't know but anyways i'm just here to report the news not to say which one is real which one is fake i will leave that up to y'all to say who y'all think is clout chasing line and and just capping because somebody's capping on this whole situation because they done did a whole story saying he ain't getting the chains back because he ain't helped with a funeral that's rude come get the chains back in blood you got his sister now coming out pretty much taking pictures with the chain saying come get it back in blood i don't know this could all just be a big clout move uh but like i say i will report details and more details as the details actually come uh maybe gucci main himself will come up and actually say something maybe he'll just put it inside of a song who knows uh we'll just have to see how that goes anyways so r.i.p the big scar the good news is he was able to be buried whether that 10k went to that funeral home or whether the people that's claiming that no money was helped for the funeral at all actually paid for it uh you know he was able to be buried now as far as the chains go of course they're not going to be sending the chains back obviously that's not going to happen even if they did pay for the actual funeral uh now whoever's capping in this situation whether uh whether you know gucci main them did actually pay uh you know the funeral home directly and didn't send the money to them that's still fine because that's that's still taking care directly of big scar and not just putting the money in the hands of whoever or whether they're capping and they didn't actually send the money and they kind of rate you know made a fake receipt whoever is the one that's capping in this situation is wrong you know what i'm talking about they all it makes for great entertainment i will say it makes for a hell of an entertainment but this is like a type of story that's like dang somebody playing around with buddy's death anyways let me know something coming down below let me know what you think about this entire deal i'm out